Hello everyone and no. Started wrongly again. Uh. Mm. I love this. Hi everyone, welcome back. Before I start, I just wanted to wish you all a happy new year and I hope you conquer everything you want in life this year that you did it previously. I attempt to do that this year. We will see how it goes. Today I decided to bring a video where I can talk about my favourite beauty things that I've bought a um, while ago. December, was in December, the 26th, Boxing Day. Everything was so cheap that I couldn't just, you know, don't buy anything in Kiko, which you know, it's my favorite beauty store. When I bought this product, I uh, looked up in the internet first to, you know, I think when you buy things online, you can deeply understand what the product is about, what he has on it, the descriptions. And I look into the reviews of each product that I bought and everybody was happy about it. So I thought, <clears throat> I'm gonna get it. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so the pearls are still inside the boxes, but I've used some of them. So the first pearl that I bought was this powder, compact powder. Ooh, just by the name, you know, Kiko. I bought this powder. Ooh, sorry, don't wanna blind you. <laughs> it's really nice. I really like it though. I don't remember the prices because it was a while ago But if you want to get this powder It's in the shade 100 Yes, the products I'm showing you are not um, Expensive at all. They were all in sale. So if you hurry up and go online, you can still get them It came with this um, little It's not a brush Sponge, maybe, but I don't use it. I use it with my um, brushes. Oh yes, very good. Highly recommend it. The next product is from the collection Romantic uh, Something, which has been released a while ago in Kiko. But um, I've never seen this until the Boxing Day, which is strange. And it was this. I love the packaging to be honest, it's a blush and I haven't used it, but it's so pretty, you'll see. Okay, so to start with, look at that, oh, look at that, it's rose gold, which always the favourite isn't it, this amazing pink, it's not pink pink it's a dark pink but I really really like it it has this metallic -y part around the blush which I thought it was so cute I just love it the packaging is absolutely marvelous I love it go for it very good quality and very cheap if you want to go for this blush it's in the shade 02 the next product I bought was a product that I have purchased before and I've used every day it's what makes me feel a human and it's this pencil eyebrow yes. it comes with a sharpener and I have made a blog post about my um, makeup routine I'll leave this, the link in the description box so you can go and check it out and see more descriptions about this pencil. When I went to Kiko, I didn't know what color to go for. And so I asked for help. The girl that uh, showed me a darker color, she put on my eyebrows and I thought it was too much. And it was too much. I don't like when people see that. I don't like when people see that I'm wearing makeup because I wanted to look natural. Um, as possible so when I went for this pencil I opted for that which I am wearing right now 
So on this side you have the brush and on the other side you have the actual pencil that I haven't used because I still have the other one. By saying this you know how much, how much this can last because I bought this pencil in summer so since August until now I have been wearing it and I still have got it. If you want to get this pencil it's in the shade 02. Now I am going to go for lips wise because I bought quite a few bits and pieces. The first product I bought was this. This is a lip intensive mask and I will explain to you why I bought this. So it has three masks that you can use. This helps your lips um, stay smooth and protected. This mask hydrates your lips 100%. I haven't used this, but just by looking at the image, it seems like a form, like it has a lip format. So I think you just apply onto your lips. Not quite sure, as I said, I haven't used it. But the reason why I bought this is because I'm always taking off the skin off my lips, whether with my hand or with my teeth. I'm always like eating it and it's such a bad habit trust me sometimes it's so rare that it really hurts when I drink something or even I don't know when I'm brushing my teeth I can't even touch with the toothbrush on uh, my lips because it really hurts the next products I bought are from haha <laughs> Kiko yes they are I bought these lipsticks and I'm so excited as I said, I'm looking for something that helps my lips getting hydrated every day so I don't eat the skin. So I bought this lip scrub, which is a lip exfoliator and it looks like this. So the only thing you need to do is apply this on your lips, which I have. It doesn't taste bad, to be honest, although lipsticks and lip scrubs are not to be eaten. It wasn't expensive again, so nothing was expensive in this haul. So if you have the same problem as I do, I really highly, highly recommend that you go for this because it really helps your lips getting hydrate and trust me, it's not a good thing having this habit. Also, how cute is this mug? Yes! It's so cute. It's a picture of me with a horse. It was offered by a friend, which I love, and I'm loving this mug, to be honest. Thumbs up, fat. It was offered um, as a Christmas gift, and it has my name on it, look. And then the picture. How cute! No, I, I'm serious. It's it's amazing. Thank you very much for that. I am using it. The next product is again a lipstick. The next product is again a lipstick, which is in this packaging. Marvelous as always. It opens like this. It's this amazing color. Oh my god! I am loving it. It's the one I have right now, just to let you know. <laughs> if you want to get this lipstick, it's in the color 516. This is a pink, a really, uh, it's not light pink, but it's not a dark pink as well. It looks really cute and sophisticated. And I didn't have any pink lipstick that could suit my lips because as you know, I eat the skin from my lips. So every product that I bought without being from Kiko always, you know, it's not it's not creamy, it's not soft. So you could see the skin of my lips. So that's why I've never used lipstick until now. The next product, again, a lipstick. And it's in the same packaging. It's this amazing, oh my god, I love it. It's like a dark red brown lipstick which I love I haven't used this but I plan to 
if you want to get this one it's in the shade 511 the last lip product is in this packaging which is the same collection as this go and check it out if they still have this collection because I'm really happy with them actually and the packaging are just amazing it's like rose gold and well oh, purple like girly thing it's in this amazing packaging which is rose gold and it's this oh, oh my god I forgot how amazing this lipstick was it's just amazing it has a pinky shade on it with red I'm not good at describing products guys if you want to get this one it's in the shade 04 the last product I bought was this mask which is for oily skin which guess what yes I do have oily skin but I'm always looking for masks and things that help my skin feel fresh and not oily haven't used this really looking forward let me smell it it doesn't smell like anything maybe when I put on my oh it's green look at that it's green mm. I think today I'm gonna have a pamper evening oh yes I will this mask purifies the skin it removes dead skin that you have because along the day your skin gets tired and oily and with dead skin but you, you can't really see it this mask will help you removing those Ooh. it reduces imperfections of your skin if you are like me and you didn't know that Kiko exists before which is really strange now because it's so famous now but if you haven't heard of it go and check it out because they have amazing products from, as you saw, masks, eyes, lips, blush, powder, foundation, brushes, everything. They have an amazing quality and I have a regret a little bit from everything that I bought from Kiko, to be honest. Don't forget to click on the button that says subscribe and I hope you have enjoyed the video and if you did, give it a thumbs up. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye!